This is what dreams are made of. In reality, it's not. I'm in my bedroom filming a video talking to myself. Oh my god, Ryan, how do I become YouTube famous? I really, really want to become YouTube famous. I want to be the next Rebecca Black. A bunch of you guys have been asking me in my ass box on Tumblr. Ass box? Ass box? I guess it's called ass box now. <laughs> you tweet about it to me on Twitter. Whatever platform it is, I see this all the time. How do I get YouTube famous? Really, what is YouTube famous? We're gonna discuss this with my friend Michelle. Say hi, Michelle. Hi everyone, I'm Michelle. Michelle tells on YouTube. And we're gonna be discussing what it really means to be YouTube famous. Like, what what is YouTube famous? What is it? Oh my god, Ryan, you're so famous. <laughs> Thank you for having me in your video. It's really hard to be in the YouTube spotlight. All three of them. That three-point lighting, though. So first things first, before we even talk about our opinions on how to become YouTube famous, let's ask the actual expert. Suri, how do you become YouTube famous? You'll never be YouTube famous, Ryan Thomas Woods, unless you become the next Rebecca Black or film a video of yourself working at Target. You're right. Before we go any further, let's actually break down what YouTube famous really means. It really means three things, right, Michelle? YouTube famous is having respect, having attention, like people watching your stuff, and then having perks, like getting paid by companies to talk about stuff or getting invited to parties or to events and hosting stuff. Those are the three things and the perks really is the least important one but it's the one that a lot of people want the most. Exactly, like when most people start a channel, they're not even, a lot of the time, a lot of people aren't thinking about the content or who they want to reach out to. They're thinking, how much money are, you know, the big famous YouTubers making? I want to make that money. I want to get into these parties. Like, I need to start a YouTube channel so I can become YouTube famous. A lot of people are doing that, and I think those are the wrong reasons why you should be on YouTube. You should be on YouTube to educate, entertain, spread knowledge, and ideas and opinions to a really amazing community as opposed to I want to reach up for to be one of the stars among the universe. Real talk, I'm not sure if everyone understands how famous like the up top YouTubers are compared to a musical celebrity like Lady Gaga or Katy Perry who can't go anywhere without security guards, a YouTube person is not that famous. Yes, they're making a good amount of money compared to nothing. Making some money is incredible percentages more than making hardly any money off of YouTube AdSense. Only every once in a while does a YouTuber partner with an advertiser and make the big bucks. Being YouTube famous is really not a good career path to depend on. It's something that happens to people who work really hard and get lucky. That's the thing, a lot of people think like, oh, I just need that one viral video that will help me get famous. There's literally only one person I can think about that their viral video got them famous. I'm guessing you know exactly who I'm talking about, Rebecca Black. You can't just get lucky and be viral and then have no other videos. Like, Charlie bit my finger, like those kids are not famous kids. They have a famous video, so they got lucky, but they're not like hard workers. Charlie bit my finger, like that was such a viral video, but yet those kids aren't famous at all. I bet you like they could pass me in the street and I still wouldn't, wouldn't recognize them at all. However, if Rebecca Black walked past me, I would definitely recognize her because she continues to do more videos and continues to work harder at achieving more success. The main things I want to come across in this video is that if you are trying to achieve YouTube success, make content that you're gonna love and that others might actually love, I think that is way more important in terms of creating a YouTube channel and doing something that you love and you're gonna enjoy and other people are gonna love it as well when they find you and that itself could make you YouTube famous. If you work really, really hard, you have luck on your side, and you're just very persistent and never give up. Right, going back to those three things, getting respect, getting attention, and then getting the perks. The respect in the audience is way cooler than the perks. That's the thing, if you start making a YouTube channel and are just looking for the perks, I feel that you're not gonna get the respect nor the audience. But in retrospect, I think that with all these points in mind, the main point is just have Fun. Just be you and have fun doing what you will love doing. Ryan's right. Keep doing it if it's fun and if you do everything that we said and you're having fun and it's five years later and you're still not YouTube famous, try impersonations. Well hello there everyone, my name is Tyler Oakley. Damn it! <laughs> well hello there everyone, my name is Ryan Thomas Woods and today I'm going to be doing another Q and Slay. And I'm going to be doing it with my shirt like this. Okay? Are you kidding me? Ryan! 
My boyfriend, you're not supposed to show porn. Slay, mama, slay. <laughs> Let's be honest, Tyler's hair is gonna look like this at one point. And you're gonna see it here first, girls. So that's the end of the video. If you liked it, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. I hit the like button down below. Cause it really helps a bitch out, so help a bitch out. And Michelle, what do you think they should comment down below? Comment down below with who you think is the most YouTube famous person. Obviously, there's only one answer. Me. Obviously. Obviously it's me, Michelle. Like, I don't know who the heck Miranda Zanks is, but clearly this floral what? shirt. I'm famous. <laughs> I'm famous. I don't even know you. <laughs> <laughs> who even are you? Also, if you guys were wondering why I was wearing a sweater vest with like a Slytherin like tie, it's because we filmed another video over on Michelle's channel. And Michelle, what kind of video did we do? A Harry Potter video where we answered video questions about what sound it was in the video that was playing, and it was really cool. It was basically, what is that Harry Potter movie? So make sure you go over to Michelle's channel, give it a big thumbs up, and subscribe. Tell her you are from my channel, and enjoy the video because it was really funny and it's very Potter-esque. So definitely go check it out. And seeing as how this is part of the 12 Christmas collabs, make sure you go check out all the other 11 Christmas collabs all over there. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.